Oh, wow. This will be our third urgent care trip in a week. Oh, this one is very red. I'm happy, I can do this. I need a treat, my husband's been gone, I have three six kids, sick kids. Good morning, Mara Moments fam. I just got back from the gym. Yes, I went like this. Hey. At one point I was looking in the mirror watching my thing go like this and I was like, I'm a good time. This is, this is a good time. I'm, I'm literally the only one who hasn't coughed. Yes, she is I'm the only one not sick. You guys, Peyton has this like immune system that rivals all other immune systems. She always has. In fact, I never had her to the doctor besides her well child checkups for the first three years of her life. The first time I took her in, she had a double ear infection when she was three. And she like, she's tough. She has a high pain tolerance. She has a good immune system. So Peyton is my lone survivor currently at this it's moment. Sad. It is really sad because Rocky woke up this morning way sicker. <laughs> so, and you can hear Becca over on the couch. She's staying home again today. I'm hoping that, oh, have you seen those mountains? Oh wow. I have to, it, brief intermission, cause I just had an oh wow moment in my heart. Look, 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 the snow. Like you can see all the pine trees. Oh, can you guys see that? All the pine trees are covered in snow. Oh my gosh. I'm about to go take Rocky back to the urgent care. This will be our third urgent care trip in a week. So I think all three of them, he's been pulling on his left ear. I think all three of them now have ear infections. So I'm gonna hurry and take them because this guy is leaving me today to go to Las Vegas. God, we're going to party in Vegas. Exactly Him and Derek are going going to Vegas. It's for a work convention. My kids are so sad. We go to Vegas every spring with Derek and Bree and they're like, I want to go, like Vegas is fun. So they're a little sad and I'm a little sad. It's cold here and now it's gonna be warm with daddy so he gets to pack all of his summer clothes. <laughs> all of his summer clothes, yeah. that's why we're sad. Palmer is still asleep. Update on her, she actually is probably the most healthy of the three six. She's getting better every day. Um, Beckham is, this will be the third time he's gotten his antibiotic. How you feeling, little love? Not great. He just wants to be held. What about you, big love? <laughs> huh? Good. Good? You're, he's just excited to cuddle mom all day. So we are here at the doctor's office, round three of this. It's gonna be an expensive virus our family got. She put a stamp on her head, guys. They did ask to get him tested for COVID. I did tell them no, since my other kids were negative and he's so little, I was like, no, we're not doing that. Hey, leave me alone. Okay, the doctor's coming. I see her, she's coming. <gasps> oh, this one is very red. <gasps> Good boy, you did it. I did it. Good job. All right, well, did you guys hear that? <laughs> Just as I expected. Rocky now has an ear infection. So of my four children, we have four infected ears. Unfortunately, Beckham got two of those. Peyton got zero, but spreading the wealth. Way to take it for the team, buddy. He's over here drawing some Minecraft pictures. Have an art time apparently in homeschool today. Uh, there we go. It's a slime and a creeper and a witch slime and a bat. Slime and a creeper and a witch and a what? A bat. A bat. So they're like in the block form like Minecraft? Yeah. Cool. And do you see it? The witch is holding a potion, but you you know how witches' noses are long? Uh-huh. So I had to chase the nose for the cap. Oh, really? That's smart. So you can't see the cap. That's awesome. Really? So like this is the cap of it? Yeah. But it's but kind it's, of covered by your nose. Yeah. It's it's, but I really like it. Happier news, I just got a package I want to share with you. Pretty excited about it actually. So all the kids needed new shoes. So I went mostly like winter shirt shoes or nicer shoes and then some other ones too. So Old Navy had a 50% off sale. You guys know that that is when I buy most of my kids stuff from Old Navy. Because I hate buying it full price knowing if I'm patient. They're, they do 50% off sales like at least probably four times a year. So look how cute some of these shoes are. So these are for Peyton and you guys, she has big feet. She's gonna be tall. So like these were like 13 bucks. She wears a size five. Then I got these boots for church. I bought her the cutest pink Chelsea boots. Oh my gosh, they are to die for, but they are backward apparently. Everything else came but that. Your current church shoes, are they hard to get on? 
he fights me tooth and nail to put them on. Apparently they're like tight. They're like a faux leather, anyways. So we're going back to what he used to have. they're size one. That's what, well these are size two, I think. But I just got a pair like this kind of a brown color. It'll go with black, it'll go with navy, it'll go with khaki. He's just gonna call these church shoes. So he won't wear these other times. And then he likes these shoes a lot. This is probably the third pair of these I've bought from Old Navy, just in black. And he likes them, they just slip on really easily. Would you prefer wearing Nikes or just wearing like something like that? Nikes. Oh, well, apparently we're getting, but will you wear these? Yes. Yes, yes. So I got those for him and then Palmer's are over here somewhere. She hid them. <gasps> look how cute these are. So these are like the same ones Peyton got, but hers will be pink. These are like Chelsea boots. And look how cute these little ones are. So these will be her church shoes. Really excited about my Old Navy purchases arriving. And I'm gonna let him stay here for a little bit. Gee leaves for Vegas in two to three hours. Two to three. So I'm gonna go get Rocky's prescription. I just laid him down, he's so tired. And I'm gonna look for a Beyblade for this kid. Cause I had to bribe him with a Beyblade to get his nose swabbed, huh? Yeah, but then then it, it only spins for like 10 seconds or less. Yeah, I wasn't gonna go into it, but the Beyblade we bought was less than acceptable, so. Yeah. We are gonna return that one and get a new one. I'm gonna go get probiotics for all of them since they're on antibiotics. I'm getting an antibiotic, probiotic, and I just don't wanna have to go to the store while JD's gone, I have so. the most. I have the most ear infections. Like it's a competition? <laughs> Two. I'm back from the store. And while I was there, I got sidetracked, but it was really nice to just be by myself for a minute before JD leaves. So I picked him out some healthy treats. This man is eating really healthy. But you also, like he's going on a road trip, right? From the natural section, some dark chocolate covered almonds, gum, Gatorade Zero, a Gatorade to refill it in, a sparkling ice coconut limeade, his zip fizzes, got him some almonds, jerky, grapes, carrots, sunflower seeds. Grace. Not sure adequately like, honey, thank you so much. I already did. She got flowers. flowers. Guys, they had all these flowers on sale for a dollar. So I'm gonna take some to my friends and now I hope my friends don't watch this vlog so they know that the flowers <laughs> only cost me a dollar. So I got four of them. Their are are for a dollar. I was like, dollar ninety nine. Mm -hmm. well, one of them was a dollar ninety nine, but it's like three times as big as the other one. So I have to get myself flowers because my husband's going out of town and didn't get me any flowers. Boy, right, that's not over yet. <laughs> 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 oh, I'm gonna miss him, you guys. Someone's awake and he is not feeling good. My poor sweet baby. He's so okay. He just got him his first round of antibiotics, so hopefully that will help. He has a fever of 101. So I just gave him, I can't really give him any cold medicine, he's so little. So I did find some homeopathic stuff that's good for babies at Walmart. We're trying that as well as a humidifier, essential oils. I'm taking a lot of emergencies and vitamins so that he can get that for the breast milk. I'm having all three kids with their colds suck on my drinks, drink out of my straws so that I can get it so I can make antibodies for the kids. I just got him more ibuprofen. I'm just... Like there's nothing else I can think of doing and it's just breaking my mama heart. In other words, she is just like Dwight Schrute. She says, cough all over my face and they'll cough all over her face and she'll build those antibodies. JD's gone. I'm so sad. But Peyton's here. Yeah. But and if there's anybody that reminds me of JD, it's Peyton. I didn't say bye. She didn't get to say bye and she's kind of sad and I didn't even get to say bye. I probably would've said bye with you guys and the camera on but Derek came in like a wrecking ball and Got him out of here. So I'm sad JD is gone. I just laid Rocky down for a nap though and I'm gonna go edit the vlog. Guys, it takes me about two hours every time I have to get a vlog out to you guys. Not to edit necessarily, but then to edit, upload, and do all the SEO that goes with it. So I've got, hopefully Rocky will take a decent nap so I can go do that. I put the sick three down for naps. So I told Beckham and Palmer, you do not have to go to sleep, but you gotta lay down and watch a show and calm your body. So hopefully our bodies will heal. I'm also pumping them with fluid. We're going to bed early tonight, trying to avoid sugar, that's kind of hard. But we can do this team. We are gonna be healthy. We are doing our affirmations. I am healthy, I am strong, I'm happy, I can do this. <laughs> no, really though. So it's 6.30, I just made the kids some French toast. At least 50% of them are crying and I think we should get out of the house. So I'm gonna buckle them up. I actually am having Beckham miss his basketball game. 
It's just not worth it where he's not playing 100%. So we're gonna go get a sugar cookie from the store and take around these beautiful flowers to a few of my friends. Just get out of the house for a little bit so that when we get home, it can be bedtime. Bye. Okay, I got lemon Bye. sugar and the other two got normal sugar. I got another flavored water. I never thought I'd be the kind of person that would buy flavored waters, but I need a treat. My husband's been gone. I have three six kids, sick kids. So we're gonna do a flavored water and I'm happy about it, dang it. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. It is 10:17. Peyton and Palmer are still awake. I am discouraged and exhausted. JD has been gone now, just like half a day. But he was gone all day yesterday too. And so I just feel like he hasn't been here since the kids got sick. So I'm overwhelmed and tired. And I wanna be positive for you guys and it's helpful. So you help me because it helps me look at it a positive way. <sighs> Grateful I can be here for my kids. Grateful they seem to be feeling better. Grateful for modern medicine. See, this is helping me. My mood is increasing by the minute, but I wanna be real with you too that sometimes life is hard and that's okay. You can still have a bad day. You can have a bad week, a bad year, multiple bad years, and it's still a good life. I'm going to go try one more time to get Palmer to bed. Please bless. Cross your fingers, say a prayer, all the good vibes that Palmer goes to sleep. It is bedtime for all of us here at the Bauer household. Thank you for being part of it. Thank you for all your well wishes as my babies have been sick. We will see you tomorrow for another great day.